Generic medications can save money. As a medicine's been around for longer, they can become generic, and often that means that we can save resources by not spending a lot of money on medications. However, sometimes those generic medications don't make sense for patients. Epilepsy is one of those diseases where that's probably the case. For a lot of people with epilepsy who are stable on their brand name medication, switching them to a generic, the problem with doing that is not so much the idea that the generic is not good or not adequate. If it hadn't been good, it wouldn't have been approved by the Food and Drug Administration. The problem is the fluctuations when people go from one generic to another. There was a study of several years ago looking at one specific anti-epilepsy medication, so looking at a medication, topiramate. And what happened is they took people on brand name Topamax, and what they did is they either kept them on it or they switched them to one generic manufacturer, in this case Teva, manufacturer of topiramate, or they switch them to the way that usually happens in clinical practice, which is you go to your retail pharmacy and one day it's one generic manufacturer and the other day it's another generic manufacturer. People who were in that real world experience, what happened is they had breakthrough seizures. So those people who remained on brand name Topamax, those people did not have those breakthrough seizures. The people who were switched to one standard gen generic topiramate did not have the breakthrough seizures. It was the people who had those fluctuations in their dose of the medication because they were switched from generic manufacturer to generic manufacturer. Unfortunately, that's the way things happen in the real world. When a patient goes to a retail pharmacy or when they go to another type of pharmacy, what happens is they're given a different generic manufactured medication month to month. And what that can do is lead to breakthrough seizures. Now, breakthrough seizures are a bad idea. Breakthrough seizures are dangerous. They can even be deadly. And in many states, people are not allowed to drive after having had a seizure. And so that means that we want to try to avoid our patients with epilepsy having any more seizures. And once a patient is stable on a medication, it probably makes sense for them to stay on that. As chair of Florida's Medicaid Pharmacy and Therapeutics Committee, we worked hard at making sure that patients who were on anti-epilepsy medicines for an on-label reason of epilepsy were able to be maintained on branded anti-epilepsy medications instead of being forced to switch to generic medications.